Check out my new sponsor, MMO EXP. They're not the fastest in the world, but I'm telling you guys right now, they are the cheapest coin seller on the market right now. I'm talking $25 per mil. Plus, my code BKINDLE will save you 5% off your order. What is going on, everybody? We are back with video numero dos of the day. It's two IRL football videos. We'll go back to some Madden content probably tomorrow. But earlier today, I released my NFL playoff predictions with a surprise Super Bowl team. So if you haven't seen that yet, definitely go check that out. And in the comment section below, let me know. Who is your pick to win the Super Bowl? But in today's video, boys, we are going to be doing some reaction highlights. Basically, in week 17, the regular season's done. We're heading into the playoffs now, obviously. And there were two things that happened in the Bears-Packers game yesterday. One, the Packers clinched the number one seed in the NFC. The NFC runs through Lambeau, the frozen tundra. It's going to be rough for anybody going in there in January. And then two... Aaron Rodgers is the MVP. Patrick Mahomes is out. Derrick Henry's out. Kamara's out. Josh Allen's out. It's his. It's all but locked up, man. The guy had 51 total touchdowns this year. And what do you have? Five interceptions? 51 touchdowns. And like five interceptions. That's unheard of. That's godly numbers. And he had the second best quarterback rating of all time behind Aaron Rodgers. He literally is second all time to his own record. Dude's a dude's freaking amazing. He's one of the greatest of all times and arguably just had the best season of his career. So we're going to be reacting to some of his highlights in a little bit short video, about five minutes. But this video is Aaron Rodgers' best year yet, 2020-21. to 21. Highlight mix by MCQ37. Highlights with 11,000 subscribers. If you want to check out this video or go subscribe to him, I'm going to leave a link to his channel and this video down in the description below. Definitely go check it out, boys. But we're going to hop right into it. I'm excited. Oh, my God. If you want to see more reaction videos, definitely be sure to hit that like button. The more you guys smash that like button, the more this video gets seen by other people. The more views, the more likes. It lets me know you enjoyed this type of content, and then I can continually post it. So, if this is something you're interested in, leave a comment down below of what else you would like to see me react to. Anyways, boys, I mean, it, let's watch the Go Do Go Things. I mean, the dude has 400 touchdowns and fewer than 90 interceptions. Go. That's unheard of. That, 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 that's not, that, it, I, I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't even seem, it doesn't even seem real. It God, that's a sexy real. man. That he can, I mean, here he is, and now he just had his fifth 35 uh, touchdown passing season, which is an NFL record number. I didn't know he had that NFL record. What was it? 35 touchdowns, five five seasons? I didn't know that he actually had that record. I know he just took the record for most 40 yard touchdown passes this year, I believe. But that's going to be broken by Patrick Mahomes within the next, like, 10 years. I can make an argument. Aaron Rodgers oh, God, is the most valuable player. Whoa, 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 whoa! Skip, settle, settle, hold up, hold up. Yes, that is true. And damn, that is a beautiful picture of Aaron. The, the, just the neck beard, everything. Oh my God. Anyways, Skip has cons constantly, constantly on Twitter, on his show, on freaking whatever he's on, said that Aaron Rodgers is one of the most over valued quarterbacks one of the most overrated quarterbacks of all time and that he he doesn't get enough hate for basically anything skip hates on uh rogers 24 7 basically saying he's an over a quarterback that his numbers like just don't match that shit like that and guess what what which is it he just said he's the most valued quarterback i'm so confused bro this guy rides tom brady's dick like it's nothing he hates on aaron Rodgers literally all the time i bet if i type in aaron Rodgers hate there'll be like five skip bayless clips right there but anyways let's move on skip bayless is a clown bro oh deep ball deep ball lizard man damn he's like going to the side Oh my god. The MVS effect in full force this game. Dude catches it in triple coverage on like a third down where we had to go 98 yards just to tie the game up. And then in overtime, like two plays into overtime, he fumbled the ball and gave a Colts a win. <laughs> like, it's the MVS roller coaster, man. The ups and downs. He's gonna get a lot of big touchdowns, but he is gonna piss you off. So fucking much. Oh, that's yes, back. Oh, pressure in his face. 
That is a beautiful throw right there, dude. Devontae Adams and Aaron Rodgers is going to go down as the best duo in NFL history. At least up there with, like, the Montanas and the Rice and shit like that. They continue to play throughout their whole careers. Obviously, Devontae's just a lot younger. Oh, he's wide open. He's wide open. Lizard, man. Oh, my God. Why are you so slow? Oh, God. This game was bad. Why are we even showing this highlight? Hey! That's my fucking quarterback. Dude just freaking nosedived into him. If I'm 35 right there, I'm going over there, beat his ass. Hey, chew pump chump. It's probably the only thing Aaron Rodgers and I have in common is we're chew pump chumps. Communication in the opening quarter. Time for Rodgers. End zone throw. Oh, Robert Tunyon. Oh, he barely even touched him. He just slipped. How'd this guy not make the Pro Bowl over? Fucking Evan Ingram. Oh my god, that was a... Oh, uh, there's turn. One thing, Aaron Rodgers, obviously, he is probably the best talent of all time. But his mechanics, like if you're talking about perfect NFL mechanics, he ain't it. He'll make, him and Stafford will make like the weirdest, most unorthodox throws you can imagine. And it's just not mechanically sound, but yet it's a fucking dot every single time. Yeah, look at what was that? That was just a little like I don't even know. Like he didn't set his speed, his body was like twisted all sorts, and it was a dot. Oh my god! And yeah, he was wide open, but he's falling backwards, throws it off one foot. Dude, he just straight up said fuck it, but he still throws everything so accurately. Ben Tate's just always open. The MVS effect. Now show his drops. Oh my god. Dude, look at this. Devante caught that ball at the fucking line of scrimmage. And he wasn't going against, like, some rookie corner who doesn't know who he was doing. That was Darius Slay right there. He just stiffed him to the ground, caught the line of scrimmage, and ran 10 yards to the end zone. Like, he just straight up out played him in every way of the game right there, bro. Every single way possible. He just out played a top 10 cornerback. Hey, Lizard Man. King shit. Oh, MBS! It's good coverage, too, and he catches that shit, but yet he'll drop one like yesterday right in his hands. Big dog! No, no! There was a, no push-off! That was clean! Rap, that was clean! Dude, I st I just need to pause it for- I'm still so mad! How did Robert Tunyon not make the Pro Bowl this year? And it would be different if somebody like, obviously Kelsey was in the NFC or some shit like that. No, it was Evan Ingram. Evan Ingram is god-awful! God awful. Not even close, bro. But yeah, you might want to cover Devontae Adams. He, he's pretty good at getting open. And, you know, pretty good at football. Oh, shit. Damn. Phew. Dot! God, that combo's lethal, bro. And even our running backs just catch everything. Helps that two of our running backs are insane on the backfield. Oh my god, that is ridiculous. That is ridiculous. Hold on, I need to rewind this a little bit. Okay, look at where Rodgers has thrown this ball. Okay, ball is, what, 30 yards in there right now. The ball's 30 yards downfield. So Rodgers had to throw this a couple seconds ago. Look at the coverage right here. The corner is definitely ahead of Devontae right now. And if when Rodgers threw it, they were probably like right around here, I'd say. And then the corner was probably back here. Like the corner definitely had better positioning, bro. He had him beat by multiple yards. Low push off. But how the fuck do you complete that? How the fuck do you catch that? That's nuts. I don't care what you say. Even if it was a push off. I thought Sternberger was going to have a big year, but instead it was Tonyan. It was Tunyon. But Sternberger was the dude. Look how fast MBS is. If only could catch the damn ball, he'd be insane. 
down years for me because a lot of times down years for me are career years for most courts. <laughs> dude, he's right. Fucking go, baby. But, dude, he's straight up. He's right. Hold up. Hold up. Aaron Rodgers supposedly was on the decline, had a down year the last two years. A down year in the last two years for somebody who threw, that's this year, for somebody who threw 26 touchdowns and four interceptions. Year before, 25 touchdowns, two interceptions. He was hurt this year, and then year before that had 40 touchdowns. And he was on a decline. 26 touchdowns, four interceptions. You go 13-3, and three, and you're playing in the NFC Championship game, and that's a down year. That speaks volume to how great Rodgers has been in his career. But if that's a down year, 13-3 NFC Championship game, with numbers like that, I will take that every fucking year. Obviously, this year, he's been a different beast. Also, 13-3, we got the one seed, a career high in completion percentage. Nope, just can't. And this one doesn't really count. He playing two games. 71% uh, completion percentage. 4,300 yards, 48 touchdowns, 5 picks on top of 3 rushing touchdowns. He had 51 total touchdowns. I believe that's the most in his career. Line was great. Best quarterback rating. <laughs> yeah, uh, his quarterback rating, 121.5 is second. Only did his 2011 MVP campaign. We're at 122.5, but he also led the uh, league in QBR. I don't know what the fuck. Adjusted net yards per pass. But yeah, look at that's a lot of shit to lead the league in. Lowest uh, interception percentage and 48 touchdowns. He liked the league in interception. Dude, the dude's just unbelievable. This is probably the best year of his career. This is probably the best team the Packers have had since their Super Bowl team. They're very well balanced. They need to fix special teams pretty bad, but offense, defense. Right now, things are clicking on all cylinders. They're hot going into the playoffs. There were one seed. Like I said, NFC runs through Lambo. Anything can happen, boys. But hopefully you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments section. Is Aaron Rodgers the MVP? Just a simple yes or a simple no. I want nothing else. Yes or no. And if you made it this far into the video, watch all the way through. Comment the dog emoji in the comments section below. Be sure to hit that like button. Once again, the more likes, the more comments, the more this video gets pushed out to other people, and the more likes and engagement I get with this shit, the more I will post reaction videos. So if this type of stuff does well, obviously I'll keep posting it for you guys, but I will need some video ideas. So down in the comment section below, comment some videos, comment some highlights, comment some player highlights, whatever you want to see, whatever you want me to react to. Let me know in the comment section below, boys. Subscribe if you're new, and I'm out. Peace.